Hi, it's time for me to sell one of my ES Low chess sets. This is the Renaissance chess set and was produced before the Low Company was uh, purchased by Milton Bradley, the other game maker. There is one piece worth noting some damage on, and that's this knight right here. Unfortunately, this is a piece that I chipped during gameplay on a marble board. Uh, at least I won the match. And I placed the knight rather profoundly on the board after a checkmate. And off came that little piece. So that was the cost of the win. The king is four inches high. And I'm not sure how well the color will come through on the video but uh, the whites are an ivory color and the blacks are uh, a very dark brown. All the felts and weights are still on each piece. And except for the knight, that's the only piece that I know of that, that has any damage. There is a great article on the internet about the ES Low Company and the chess sets that they produced and I'm going to include a link to that in my description because it was a really nice article and I found it very informative and what I didn't know is that the Low Company uh, was the first maker of Bingo and Yahtzee so the game Bingo was manufactured by ES Low and I had no idea of that so Low Company has a great history, and uh, it's worth reading the article, especially if you're interested in, uh, you know, the history behind some of the collectible items that you have. I do have another Renaissance chess set that I'm going to be selling in another auction. I'll just give a quick, quick flash here of what that is. This is another Renaissance chess set by Low. And I'll give a separate review on that. I'm just showing it to generate more interest. And also, this Gallant Knight chess set, which is unopened and uh, sort of retro cool. And finally, this partial set of Gothic chess pieces by Ganin. Really, really interesting pieces. Very stylized. So watch for my other videos, and I'll demonstrate those. Uh, but for this auction, I hope you found uh, this Renaissance chess set interesting. Interesting enough to bid, anyways. Thanks for watching.